What makes a man think you're the one? Hi, this is Helena Hart from CommitmentConnection.com and today I wanted to answer a great question from someone in our community who asks, what makes a man think you're the one and makes him want to commit to you forever? I do get versions of this question all the time, so I'm really excited to talk about this with you today. But first, if you're ready to attract the man you want and create a really loving, committed relationship, be sure to click on the button to subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay up to date on all of our latest videos. So to jump into this question today, what makes a man think you're the one? The first thing that came to mind when I read this question was he needs to feel that his life is better with you in it. This is really important. This means that he knows that it's easy to make you happy and that you in turn make him happy and it's uh, there's more positive experiences than negative. There's more good feeling emotions than drama or arguing or struggle or obstacles. So that's the first thing. He needs to know that his life is better with you in it than without you in it. And the way to do this is not by telling him all the reasons why his life is better with you in it or trying to convince him of what a great wife you would be or what a great partner you are, how wonderful the two of you are together. You can't talk a man into believing that you're the one. He has to feel it. He has to feel it for you on a really deep unconscious level. And this is where women can kind of get into trouble. They try to convince a man that his life is better with her in it or convince him of you know, how wonderful it would be if they were to get into a relationship or get married one day. And that will actually push a man away on a very deep level, especially if he's a masculine energy man. And the reason for that is because when you're trying to convince a man of something, he instinctively steps back and jumps into this resistor role or distancer role. Even if he's a nice guy and even if he really loves you, he can't help it. You know, if a man is a masculine energy man and you're trying to convince him, that's actually masculine behavior, masculine competitive behavior specifically. So he will step back into that distance or role, which typically makes us women want to step forward even more and try and convince him even more. So you really want to get out of that cycle. And the way to do that is rather than talking about how great the two of you are together or why, you know, you should get married or get committed in a relationship, you want to create positive experiences with him one moment at a time rather than telling him that your life is better both of your lives are better you know together so creating positive experiences one moment at a time this is really important this is so much better than talking about the relationship so much of the time we women think that we need to talk about all these things when a lot of times it's really not necessary <laughs> when you're leaning back in your feminine energy and creating those positive experiences with a man. Because when you do that, he will want to keep coming towards you and lean forward and lock you down, basically. Make sure that he doesn't lose you. So that's the first part of this, creating positive experiences with a man one moment at a time rather than talking about the relationship or trying to convince him of what a great partner you would be, what a great wife you would be. The second part is he needs to know that you know your value as a woman, your deep value. If you, if his life is better with you in it, but he gets the sense that you'll just kind of stick around forever and he can treat you however he wants and you're just going to stay with him because you know, you have all these strong feelings for him or you don't believe there's anyone else better out there for you he'll start to lose that attraction for you and respect. And sometimes he can't even put his finger on it. It's happening on sort of an unconscious level. So this is not about being conceited or letting a man know that you have all these other options. That's definitely not the way to go. So please don't do that. It's about just really knowing your value deep down. You know, if a man knows that you're willing to walk away if he's not stepping up or doing the job in a relationship, combined with the fact that he knows your his life is better with you in it that's what makes a man 
think you're the one and want to commit to you, want to really do the job and put effort into the relationship. So the, those two things are really important and they kind of go hand in hand. Again, I'm going to recap. That is, you know, um, when a man knows that his life is better with you in it, and he also knows that you understand your value as a woman, which is huge. You know, men need us in a lot of ways. They need us because we are much deeper than them, in my opinion, in certain areas. We're connected to ourselves and to others in a way that they can only get connected to through us. So they do need us to have that full, complete life often. So that is how a man knows that you're the one. I hope this was helpful for you. I would love to hear your thoughts on this. Let me know what you think in the comments section. And also let me know if you have any other questions you'd like me to answer in some of these videos. So thank you so much for sending in your question and I will talk to you again soon. Thanks for watching. And if you'd like to discover exactly what to say and do to get the man and relationship you've always wanted, click the button on the right side of this video to visit our website and I will talk to you soon.